that once we get to a certain age, we're supposed to get checked for breast and colon cancer regularly. But one doctor says we should also be getting screened for another type of cancer. Seven's Alexis Rivera brings us one woman's life-saving lesson. A few years ago, Sharon Vinegrad didn't feel like herself. I had chronic laryngitis, and I just, I wasn't feeling right. I didn't have the energy to do what I normally do. She went to several doctors, but they just chalked it up to stress. I was feeling frustrated because I knew something was wrong, and yet nobody could pinpoint it. Then finally, during a routine checkup, a doctor found a lump in her neck. And the fact that it came back as being cancer, I was totally beside myself. Sharon was diagnosed with thyroid cancer. Thyroid cancer is prevalent in the United States. I mean, it's predicted to be 50,000 new cases a year. Dr. David Bimston says up to 70% of women in the U.S. have thyroid lumps. Some cancerous, some not. Thyroid cancer can run in families, but because there may be no symptoms, doctors say people should be screened every year. Everyone gets a colonoscopy whether when you turn 50, whether you have a family history of colon cancer or not. This is an ultrasound of her thyroid gland. By the time Sharon's cancer was found, it had spread to her lymph nodes. She had surgery to remove her thyroid gland and underwent aggressive radiation treatment. But there is good news for her. And thyroid cancer is probably the most curable cancer other than some minor skin cancers. Sharon is now on the mend. Finally being able to taste and taste my food and everything tastes normal, which I'm happy to say. If you don't mind, I'm going to come around and I'm going to feel your neck real quick. Sharon gets checked every six months and feels great. She says her story is a life-saving lesson for everyone. I'm living proof that if you don't feel right, you need to take a proactive approach and really take care of it. Thyroid cancer can strike men or women at any age, so it's important to ask your doctor to screen you at your next exam. In the Plex, Alexis Rivera, 7 News.